A tremendous noise around the Kazan Arena. A tremendous arena. And Argentina, as they have for every game they've played at this tournament, have got the lion's share of the seats. Messi Sean, particularly in the first half, last time out against Nigeria, he's got to sparkle again. We're halfway through the year, and we're into part two of the 2018 World Cup. It's Di Maria. Di Maria's managed to get the cross over, but the cross is over and out. should get more of the ball in the middle of the pitch. Mbappe. It's Mascherano who came slamming in. It's a free kick for France. Mbappe was too quick for the lot of them. He's wonderful uh, when he's got the ball at his feet. Runs at such pace, doesn't he? Such a threat. It's time for the biggest stars to shine as brightly as they can. Griezmann's one of them. Armani was beaten, all ends up. Mbappe couldn't climb. Armani couldn't get it. There's a return. In comes Popper. And Tagli Fico beaten for that by Mbappe. Watch him go. Mascherano won't get near him. And Mbappe down! It's a penalty for France! Grabbed at in desperate fashion by Marcos Rojo, who's collected a yellow card as well. Well, it's, it's a ridiculous challenge from Rojo. 100% penalty from here. I think it's Benega gives the ball away, but watch this for a run. Championships on home soil two years ago. Here comes Griezmann. France have the lead. Most of the stadium is silenced. The little pocket of putty France is quite the opposite. France won, Argentina nil. France go long and go quickly, and Mbappe goes down again in the box. And the referee... Well, has he given another? Goodness me. Yellow cards out. Has he pointed to the spot, or is it just outside? Well, first and foremost, unbelievable pass from Pogba. Love this. Great run. Trying to second guess who'll hit it is another problem. It is Pogba who does hit it. Benega is on the ball again. Going for goal, it's a big deflection on. That was Perez on the spin and for France. Giroud getting into the middle. Griezmann wandering there by himself, but putting it into. That's a better ball in. Poked right across goal though. And there it's a. Uh... Very strong appeal for handball from yeah. Gabriel Mercado. It's a great run from Mercado. Really positive. He did clip the arm of Umtiti. I think he was desperately trying to get it out of the way. Messi. Pavon. Pavard gets it. Griezmann. Pavard. Giroud who went flying for it. Any sort of slight touch and it might have been a problem. A long way from goal, but what a strike! What a strike from Angel Di Maria! It is a shot from the heavens! A rocket out of nowhere has made it France 1, Argentina 1. Well, you won't see. Well, you won't see many better strikes of a football than this. Look at that. Probably the best goal of the tournament. So. The first time in the game, he's taking on Pavard. That's better already, look. And beating him and having his shirt tucked. A free kick for Argentina. Now he breaks out, it's just too high for him. Messi, Messi's got it in! 
deflected in. Mercado claims the touch. A golden one for Argentina. The defender who scored the first goal of Jorge Sampaoli's time in charge of the Argentinian national team has just scored one that's much more important. Well, the free kick comes to Messi, he does well to try and get a shot in. You could argue it wouldn't have troubled Lloris, but it doesn't matter because the deflections come off Mercado. I should put the back. Giroud can't find Griezmann. What's Fazio done? Griezmann in, but he can't get around to score. Oh. And Federico Fazio's heart can come back to a more normal level. Calamitous, wasn't it? It's a flick from Giroud, no danger. Let the keeper, oh, he's take, he can't wrap his foot around it, Griezmann. That's a let off, that is. Fazio just come on. And this can get to it. He did. Mbappe leaves it. Pavard hits it! <laughs> it's another glory! Celebrations mirror those of Argentina's not long ago. Benjamin Pavard with a dream strike for his first France goal. Brilliant ball from Matuidi. It's a good cross. When it comes out to Pavard, you're thinking, take a touch, but now look at that for a strike. We have seen some strikes. I mean, he's waited for it, lovely, and uh, cuts across. Fernandez in. Mbappe! Mbappe! Watch out, world, there's a new number 10. Kylian Mbappe's star is shining now, and it's risen higher than his. 3-2 France, the young man most likely has restored their lead. Well, he's been the best player on the pitch, Pogba's involved again, good ball out to the left-hand side. I still think the keeper's going to have a look at this again, comes to great skill there, has a goal on his left foot, goes right through the keeper, it's a bad mistake. He can save that on his feet when they won the World Cup in 98. Giroud there gets it, it through. He's done it again. The boy wonder has two for France. France have put four in the Argentina net and look well set for the quarterfinals. He's going to be a world beater. He already is. Breathtaking. What's remarkable is his calmness his age touch from Giroud lovely touch doesn't even have to break strong right new beginning for France it's Pogba now it's Giroud now oh. and it's into the side of the net rasped there by the Chelsea striker Mbappe is and he's waiting there is Mbappe uh, and he tried to be unselfish he's trying I think it's lack of quality around him out comes Armani Tamendi's lost it Pogba couldn't keep it. Messi. Now then. Messi out to Mesa. Big deflection on that, but uh, Fakir's lost possession though. And here's Messi. And Messi has managed to get through, but oh. he was off balance and he scuffed the shot. Di Maria is easily past Hernandez. He wants to beat him again. All the runs had already been made. 90th minute, corner unsurprisingly taken quickly. We're about to lose the beaten finalists. Messi in. There's a chance. Oh, maybe there's a bit of life left yet. Because Sergio Aguero only needs one chance. Hold on to your hats. There's a big two minutes on the way. 
They've not looked likely to. They might just leave themselves open at the other end. There might be a tackle like that as well. Down went Pogba. Was it Mercado who went into the tackle? It was for me, and now they have lost their heads. Giroud's got a yellow card for the part that he's played in the ensuing melee. Oh, this is incredible, this ending. Di Maria puts it in. Sergio Aguero helps it out. Drilled across, deflected away. Last touch of the match. We had excitement at the end. But in the end, it is France who've won through to the World Cup quarterfinals on a dramatic afternoon in Kazan. France 4, Argentina 3.